The overall situation we do have for you is the seven of swords in reverse with the eight of swords here. Pisces, I do feel like there is someone who's coming towards you, okay? This is someone who's feeling guilty, who's uh, tried to get away with something, okay? But someone who's been a taker in your life, all right? And there was a one-sided situation. This is the person who's coming back. This person could have ghosted you. They were lying. They were cheating. Or this was someone who's just very deceptive, okay? However, when they come back, I feel this is going to put you in a tough spot here with the eight of swords, okay? Because you're just not going to know what to do about them. Because this person left you in a situation where you were just so tied okay you just felt very stuck tied bound to and that's what's going to happen when this person comes back towards you okay you're not going to know how to deal with the situation or rather i'm feeling that you will not do anything about it okay you're not going to take any action you're just going to leave the situation where it is although they are coming back for sure all right uh, how do you see yourself pisces in this connection how do you see yourself in this connection all right six of swords in reverse with the eight of pentacles here all right so out here this is someone on this side this is someone who definitely can't move on from you pisces so you can't move on from this person all right with the eight of pentacles here this is someone out here who's working on themselves in order to work on this relationship okay definitely someone coming back to work on this connection here all right this is someone who wants to turn a new leaf like i said but this person cannot move on they either try to move on but they couldn't or they just cannot okay they're going nowhere this is someone who's just going nowhere and they're wanting to work on this relationship. But for right now, they're focusing on themselves, bettering themselves so they can better and uh, improve this relationship. All right. So someone's ready to work on this relationship with you, Pisces. All right. Tell me uh, the person on this side. Okay. How does this person see themselves in this connection with Pisces? How does this person see themselves in this connection? How does this person see themselves in this connection with Pisces? Wow. All right, we do have for the person this side, okay, we have the King of Pentacles in reverse with the Seven of Wands here. Uh, the person this side is very, very defensive very defensive okay definitely dealing with someone who's uh who, who doesn't trust you okay this person's blocked you out either they've blocked you out or they, you've blocked them out whoever the person on this side has blocked the other person out okay they're very defensive they feel they need to protect themselves okay and they're very guarded okay they're not gonna let you in okay so yeah when the good king of pentacles in reverse with this person i think is just not interested in you they're not investing their energies into you but wanting to invest into their own career goals money okay their focus is only money 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 right now they're very focused on themselves focused on their inner work this is someone who's very very private and someone who's blocked that energy of giving you okay they're not into that giving energy they're more uh, more um, greedy or someone who's just not ready to focus on this relationship okay so i'm getting here as that uh, there's one person here who's completely sabotaged the connection okay and this is someone here who's been very deceptive about their feelings or someone who ended a relationship but in a very sneaky way okay now there's that person here who's wanting to come back towards you pisces and you're very stuck in your head because you don't know what to do all right this person is getting better and better with what they can do about themselves i feel they're working on themselves and they cannot move on okay you on the other hand here you're just not going to let this person in okay you're very focused on yourself and you don't give a shit to this person you're not going to let them in all right you may want this partnership somewhere somehow okay but i feel you're working on yourself okay you're building on yourself and you're rebuilding your um confidence that this person had shaken completely when they left all right tell me what action will this person take towards pisces what action will this person take towards pisces actually tell me what this is Pisces, right? So I don't confuse myself. So I'm just going to say this as Pisces. Tell me what action will Pisces take towards this person? Tell me what action will this person take to uh, Pisces take towards this person? Yep. Whoever's on this side here, Hermit in reverse and the Death in reverse here. This person is coming out of isolation, okay? So like I said, someone who's ghosted you, someone who's isolated, who was very withdrawn from you, right? This person is coming out of isolation. They're wanting to return back to you because they cannot let you go. They're not going to let you go. They're not going to accept this ending and they will not, cannot let you go, okay? This person is hell-bent on working on this relationship and they will make it happen. The death in reverse, refusing to accept an ending out here. Like I said, you ended things with this cheater, liar, or whoever this was, right? 
and you're blocking them out flat out you're just not gonna let them in your boundaries are up okay and you're doing you this person they're ready to come towards you and build on this connection okay with the judgment here this person wants a reconciliation they want a second opportunity with you all right tell me what action will this person take towards pisces Wow, <laughs> nine of cups and the ten of pentacles. You know what, Pisces, I'm getting here? Honestly, the nine of cups, yes, it is a wish fulfillment card, right? But you know what I'm getting here with the nine of cups here? I feel, Pisces, the action that you're going to take is that your focus is your happiness, right? This is yourself, okay? And you're going to do what feels right for you. You're wanting your wish fulfillment. You're socializing. You're happy to be alone is what I'm getting, okay? You're very content with the way things are, okay? And you're in no rush to get at, at the present to get involved in a relationship with this person who's coming back, okay? And to me, with the Ten of Pentacles here, I think you're only focusing on your money. Yes, the Ten of Pentacles is the card of commitment here, but I have the Page of Wands in reverse here, which means you are not going to take any action towards this person. You're just losing. You've lost the mojo. You've lost the spark, okay? And you're not going to take any action towards this person. You don't, you, you know, it's like that. you got that bulk case kind of energy, you know? This person killed your wife. And what you're doing is you're focusing on you, and uh, you're just going to work on your career. You're, choos you're choosing to stay single, okay? After whatever, leaving this relationship, okay? You have that emotional maturity and understanding of what is important to you and what is not. And what's important to you is your stability, security, and that's what you're working towards, okay? And working towards building it. Uh, tell me, how does Pisces view this person? How does Pisces view this person? How does Pisces view this person? I think this is a cross water reading for sure, guys. This is a cross water reading. Yeah. Pisces, you view this person as the Seven of Pentacles in reverse and the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Clearly, whoever's on this side, right, they view you as someone who's given up, okay? who's put in a lot of work, a lot of effort into a relationship, okay? But things just didn't come into fruition, right? So they see you, view you as someone who's given up, like, you know, who's no more waiting, you know, no more being more persevering and adamant on making things work. They see you as, you, you've stopped putting in the work because this has turned out to be a waste of time and a disappointment. And Queen of Pentacles in reverse here, they see you as focused on yourself. You don't give a shit to them, see? And that's what you're doing, King of Pentacles in reverse here. They see you exactly as what you're doing. They see you focused on your career goals, on the material aspect of life. But they do see you as someone who's not giving a shit to them, okay? They're, you're just not investing into this person at all. Because they're, this person lacked the stable, instable, they lack the stability and security in the relationship here. Hangman and pillow, see? They see you as doing nothing. Just one second. They see you as doing nothing. They see you as probably even thinking a lot about them, but there is no action from your side. Everything's just on hold. That's what you're doing. You're, you've just kept things on hold. How does this person do Pisces? Yeah. The Fool in Reverse on the Six of Cups here. So this person views you as um, someone they have very good memories with, okay? They view you as their soulmate. But with the Fool in Reverse here, looks like this person uh, is someone who does not want to take a risk with you. This person, whoever's out here, right? This person does not want to take a risk with you. Pisces, I feel this is you, okay? Who you view this person as a soulmate. You have a lot of reminiscing about this person. You have the best of memories with this person. Again, this is a soulmate to inflame connection. A significant difference between you guys, okay? But again, at the same time, when it comes to this person, this person does not trust you and they feel it's very risky, okay? There is an opportunity of a brand new beginning here between you guys, but this person does not want to risk it because you've put them through hell and back, okay? And now they have huge trust issues with you. They're not ready to take uh, that chance with you, okay? They're not taking leap of faith. They're taking more leaps of doubt when it comes to you. Well, obviously, because we have the seven of swords in reverse here, right? So this is someone who's done some, who's played dirty, who's, who's done uh, something very wrong in the relationship, okay? Again, whoever, it, this could be deception in the way, not only cheating, lying. I don't get cheating or a third party energy here, but cheating in a way or lying in a way, being deceptive, sneaky behavior, okay? As in not being open, uh, open about their feelings, not being open about their intentions. 
honestly Pisces I feel you're dealing with someone who has a lot of love for you okay and they refuse to let you go okay they want to work on this relationship genuinely this time okay but you on the other hand here you know exactly what is good for you and exactly what is not okay and that's what you're protecting and that's what you're doing right now and this is all happening because you view them as someone who just cannot be trusted okay moon in reverse here so yeah there could have been something that has been revealed some secrets could have been come out okay where and now this person has lack of has clarity about what they should really expect okay and whatever the truth has been revealed or whatever has been come out has been out that is forcing this person to view you this way okay with the moon in reverse here you know the moon in reverse does not always have to be some kind of secret that has been revealed this is also where someone had a particular opinion about the other person but something came crashing down there was a tower moment between you guys okay and whatever the tower moment was right everything crumbled okay and the truth was out in the open okay that this was not a, a connection that was built on a on a, a very um, secure foundation okay the foundation was very crooked maybe someone lied maybe someone was deceptive maybe someone said something and they didn't uh, and there were broken promises okay whatever it was but there was some kind of deception done here and whatever has been revealed has put this person in a spot where they don't trust you anymore yes they do have the best of memories with you but uh, when it comes to coming towards you or walking towards you i don't think they're having it all right what are the blockages of the challenge in this relationship what's the blockage Two of Cups, blockages for you guys to come together. <sighs> Give me one more card. Why is the Two of Cups here? The blockage. Three of Cups in reverse, see? Okay, now Three of Cups in reverse to me is like the blockage out here is the Two of Cups because you both are just not being able to come together on the same page, okay? There is this lack of reconciliation here. The love is there. The love is there okay but it's like this person still has a lot of love for you you too do you too do but it's like you're literally forced to move away from this person because of this person's uh, approach towards you or their habits or seven of swords in reverse is the card of where someone has a tendency to keep coming back to you you know they're very on and off on and off and you're fed up you're tired this time you're not letting them in easy you know and now your focus is completely changed your focus is the ten of pentacles here and probably it's money that makes you happy or whoever's on this side money that makes you happy and makes you very fulfilled or it's just that security stability that if you're not getting it with this person you're ready to go ahead and find it with someone else but your biggest blockage out here is to get you guys together on the same page okay but someone is just not interested in reconciling i'm getting here with the three of cups in reverse here this is someone who needs alone time this person needs to be on their own okay they don't want to be with you right now or you don't want to be with them right now okay but the love is there but someone refuses to get, like um, accept that the love is there and this person won't cheat you this time around. But well, it's up to you guys. Just start in reverse here at the bottom of the deck. One of you is a very is thinking very negatively about the situation. Okay, someone has a very negative mindset. Uh, someone's just given up hope and faith that things will ever work out. Okay, but your your patience is your your faith is being tested, Pisces. If this is you, your you know, faith is being tested how much you have faith in the universe something was very destined to happen okay in order for this person to realize that this is what they need if they want the pisces if they want pisces okay so that's why something was very destined and fated but i don't know uh what's the image ace of cups in reverse you're shut down emotionally very disappointed what's the immediate future for this connection What's the immediate future of this connection? Yeah, babe, you're walking away because so someone's walking away from here. Someone's walking away from here because nine of pentacles and eight of cups here. One person is choosing. Okay, now I'm getting two scenarios. So either this is your one person here who's choosing to be single. They're okay on their own. You know, this is someone who's, uh, you know, they're not uh, uh, being single because they have to, but they're choosing to be single. Okay, they're okay on their own and which is forcing the other person to walk away. I feel this person's coming back to you. Okay, but um, I, I don't feel you're going to entertain this person here. Or the other thing is, Pisces, this looks like you with the Nine of Pentacles and Eight of Cups here. It looks like you're choosing to be on your own. You're choosing to be single. You're self-sufficient, abundant, focused on your financial independence, focused on your money, career, business, etc. And you're cutting the emotional cord with this person. Yeah. It could be either ways, okay? 
but yeah, I do see disappointment here from one person here who needs to walk away because other person's just not ready to give in. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. So take it how it resonates, okay? That's what I have for you, Pisces. I hope this reading resonates with you. Do leave your comments below, like, share, subscribe, and I will see you next time.